and welcome to another puddle episode. Today, I would like to introduce you to some boys, but not just any boys, the best boys. And if you've seen my video on Ferality, you've seen these boys already. Best boys are a really awesome original species that came from VRChat, and their community is one of the loveliest communities that I have ever had the pleasure of being a part of. So for this episode, I'm going to go all into their origins, their community, their worlds, and how you yourself can become one. A huge thank you to their community leader, Rusty, who happily answered my barrage of questions that made this video possible. Uh, I, I don't quite feel right doing the video like this, though. Um, actually, let me go get changed. Give me a sec. Ha! Ah, there we go. Much more fitting. Welcome to the Best Boy Homeworlds. Like, check it out. This place is awesome. I love it. Like, let me show you around a little bit. I'll give you a proper tour later, but like, this place is so cool. Look, we got some, oh, we have some resident best boys over here. Hello, fine sirs. How do you do on this great afternoon? Hello. Well, I guess they're not feeling very talkative today. But yeah, so this is the world of the best boys and I myself am now a best boy. Isn't it cute? Meet me in the tavern where I shall tell you the tale of the best boys beginnings. <laughs> There you are. It's one way you got to. Ah, uh, here you go. Here's a drink to help you get comfy. Eek. Cheers, big ears. <laughs> Nothing quite like some best boy brew. Alright, let me tell you the story. So, the best boys first appeared in the age-old pre-pandemic year of 2017. VRChat was a very different place back then. Like, it's definitely not the VRChat we know today. There were barely any furry avatars, let alone free ones. And this was about the time that the Knuckles meme was reigning supreme, raiding public servers left, right and center, becoming an absolute public nuisance. A user by the name of the Kibblemeister really wanted to combat this. So they created their very own free little furry avatar with its likeness inspired by the insanely popular fursuiter, Telephone. They grew to be pretty popular and not too long after a whole community had formed counter-raiding public service to keep the Knuckles meme under wraps. These super adorable avatars were nicknamed the best boys because, well, they are truly the bestest of boys. But over time, the name just stuck. However, not all was peaceful in the world of the best boys because, as per typical furry fashion, an explosion of drama had arisen and the community was being torn to shreds as discords, artworks, worlds, everything was being deleted left, right and centre until only a husk of what the community once was remained. Many, many others tried to revive it and multiple rival best boys communities formed, but none were quite like what the thriving community used to be. But this is where we meet Rusty Dusty Fox. In her corner of the community, they decided to start what was called the Best Boy Project, a huge revival effort to bring back the community through heaps of new Best Boy content. Rusty became the community leader, and through an incredible amount of time, effort, passion, and money, we now have a lot more Best Boy models, new Best Boy worlds, lore, a solid Discord, and a website to tie it all together. Rusty's goal was for the best boys to be as easily accessible and user-friendly as possible with an extremely supportive and friendly community behind it. Right now, their Discord has over 1,700 members and they recently celebrated their third anniversary, so I'd say goal achieved. It's definitely not stopping there though. Rusty and the team have so many plans for the future, including new maps, new models, maybe even plushies. It just depends on how much support they can get. So, yeah, that's the story of the Best Boys. At the moment, there are three different kinds of Best Boy avatars available. Actually, let's go back to the front and I'll show you. Whoop, oh, this is the table. I'm sorry, no! Okay, here we are. So, these are the types of Best Boy avatars that are available. We've got the latest one, which is the Best Boy HD, which is the one that I'm using right now. We've got the Toon version, which is a much stockier, chibi version. Hang on, let me put it on. You know, <laughs> there we go. So, this is the Toon version, which is a much more toonier, smaller, cartoony proportioned version. I actually have my own Picari version of this one. Where is it? There we go. <laughs> I made the ears a little bigger because I just really wanted nice big ears. But yeah, so this is the Toon one. And then over here, we got the classic. 
So this is the one that was inspired by the original Best Boy Avatar. So this is what they originally looked like back in 2017. Still super cute. And right now, at this very moment, there is actually a chibi version that is in the works. So that should be out in a couple of months, which is super duper exciting. And after that, they plan to make a kimono style one. All of them absolutely 100% free to do whatever you like with. If you're new to customizing and uploading pre-made avatars, I highly recommend the best boys as a place to start. The way they've organized the Unity packages is extremely nice and tidy, so it is super duper easy to find everything. And on Discord, the community is absolutely lovely, so if you ever run into anything or get stuck, they're there to help you. Whew, getting a bit stuffy in here, let's go back outside. Ah, there we are. Much better. So, my first introduction to the Best Boys was when I started getting more into VR chat a lot earlier this year. Because, like, I'd seen these little avatars running around, but, like, I had no idea what they were. Until I first met my friend, Sin. She was also sporting a Best Boy avatar, and I was asking about it, so she's like, What? You haven't heard of the Best Boys? So she took me to their hub world and told me all about them, and I was just astounded like I had no idea that there was so much lore and so much work behind these little avatars. Later in the year at the VR Furry Con Ferality, I thought I'd go check out the Best Boy Meetup and that event was honestly one of my most favorite events of the entire con. Everyone was incredibly kind and sweet, we had a lot of fun and it's where I got to meet Rusty. She gave us a full guided tour of the current Best Boy Hub, which is the one that you're seeing right now. So how about I do the same for you? Um, where do we start? I mean, well, we can go for a swim. Yeah, wee! <laughs> I mean, I guess Best Boys can breathe underwater. Not sure about that. <laughs> All throughout this world, you will find these little <laughs> Best Boys standing around. And every single one of these are public avatars. So if you want to be one of these, you just click. Loading. Oh, and there we go, look! Now we're twins! Yeah, look at us, aren't we so cute? <laughs> I do quite like this one, actually. Then as we traverse through the world here, what have we got? We've got the staff, of course. Ah, yes. Shout out to every single one of these people. These guys are amazing. Like, I cannot put into words just how much has gone into all this Best Boy stuff. Like, I don't have any words that feel big enough to, like, express it. Now just a bit further down, we've got the speaker's hall. Let's go inside. Yeah, so this is where the best boys hold their staff meetings. Like, how cool is this? They've got like an actual medieval fantasy type meeting room. Like, this is actually so cool. Like, here's a picture of one of them. Like, you got Rusty standing there in the middle on the, on the tall bit here and all the staff sitting around on the chairs. Like, it's cool. <laughs> Also check out the amazing stained glass artwork up there. I love the stained glass aesthetic they've got going on with like this entire world. It's it's so good. <laughs> but yeah, so that is the meeting hall, but continuing onwards, the Rocky Inn. The world that we were in before wasn't the Rocky Inn. That was the original Best Boy Tavern. This is a new one. There we are. Welcome to the inn. It is so nice and like just warm feeling in here. Like I want to be here in real life with a beer so bad. <laughs> Over here we have the lovely case of very precious gold best boys that you should definitely not ever touch and throw around. Oh, also when I grab stuff, my tongue hangs out. So there we go. This, this is the golden best boy. Super, super, super cute. Um, but yes, you can, you can throw them. <laughs> Over here we have the all-important kegs with the best boy beer. Yeah, here is a fresh bottle of their best boy brew. They say it's very tasty, so bottoms up. That's how you drink beer, yeah? Got a lovely fireplace here that we can warm ourselves by. It's so nice. Mmm, warms. And if we head upstairs, there's a cool little chill area. You got some pillows for you to sit and chill on. I've uh, also got a mirror over here. Hello, I am Best Boy. I am the bestest of boys. Yeah, Best Boy. Yeah, Best Boy. <laughs> oh, and one of the really cool things that I forgot to mention is with these Best Boy avatars, you actually have a lot of control. They have been made really, really well. Like, look, I can control my ears. And I have full control over my face as well. Nee, sad, sad. 
Anger. Bleh. <laughs> I can also control my tongue. Bleh. Oh, and I can also control my tail. Go to the mirror. Look at me! I can do around circles, up and down. See, I'm, I'm doing that. I'm controlling that. How cool is that? But, moving on, I believe there's one more place to see. The Museum of Arts. Now, this is cool. Brace yourself. We first off with this lovely stained glass window, and like, if you actually look at it close in VR, you could like, see all the little divots like an actual stained glass window it's crazy but then as we exit there we have this amazing hall full of artwork all artwork that has been made by the community like check it out it is uh, amazing i love just coming here and just looking at all this artwork it is so cool <laughs> the best boys really are just one of the most amazing communities that i've ever been a part of but like I, again i can't find the right words to express the infamous of it everyone's amazing ah! so if you're looking for a community or a cute vr chat avatar then i would highly recommend the best boys but for now let's pass you back on to the room Whoop. Whoop. there we go so yeah as you can see a lot of passion has gone into the best boy project and there is plenty more to come as well however as the avatars are and always will be 100% free, they really depend on support from the community to keep things running. If you want to help out, they have a Patreon, a coffee, and a merch shop. Any one of those will help the best boys to continue developing and expand. Like, I would really love to see them reach the level of producing plushies, but those are certainly not cheap to have manufactured. A huge shout out to the entire best boy team for their incredible work, I cannot wait to see where they go from here. But that's about it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you're staying safe and staying awesome. And I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one. Bye. This month's anniversary shout outs go to Lightning Runner and Beagle and Red who have been here for three years. Thank you guys so much. Then for two years, we've got Morgan, Jinxie, Brian Thompson and Moonish Daydream. And one year, we've got Shadowpaw, Tidepod and Ryder. Thank you guys so much for the incredible support.